Hey people of YouTube, this is Sony Game Tester, aka Sith Lord eBay, also known as Alex. Today I have accomplished something, um, something that interested me a lot, and I finally got it running. It took me a couple hours, but I got it running. Uh, let me let me uh, tell you my utilities that I'm using. I'm using my PlayStation 2 controller. Don't mind my iPhone at my computer. Okay. Mainly is just the controller and the computer itself. Um, so here's a taste of what I could do with my controller. Right now, I want to play a favorite game of mine. It's a really interesting game. Let that load. Okay. Let's get a ROM going. Let's get an SNES ROM here. Let's see, Killer Instinct. Alright. So while that's loading, let's get that out of the way here. Let's see. Okay. So as you can see, Killer Instinct is playing. I got my PS3 controller right here. Okay. I'm gonna press start. You can see the back screen. Player one. So you can see I'm not touching the keyboard. As you can see. Oh my favorite one. Blue. As you can see, I'm controlling the game with my PS3 controller. I don't know if you could see that clearly, but probably not. Uh, let's see if I could get this a little higher somewhere. Okay, so here's my controller, right? So I'm gonna be, hopefully I could show you guys. So here it goes. Kick your ass a few times. Okay. So as you can see, I'm controlling it with my PS3 controller. Back, forward. So you can see, I'm controlling it. I'm gonna throw her off. <laughs> she goes. As you can see, I'm not using my computer. I'm using the PS3 controller right now. Right now I'm going to put my name on it. There you go. Okay, how am I doing this? I'll show you what you need to do this. Let's quit this. Okay. This is what you basically need. You need... I will put the... The URLs in the description. So don't worry, but I will go over it on here. You're gonna need to go to this website. Okay. That's the website you need to go to. To get the emulator. SNES and NES. The ROMs... I'm sorry, but you're just going to have to Google that. I did it. I had to Google all the ROMs. Fortunately, I got some of my favorite ones. Some I can because they're uh, copyright protected. Um, so you could com uh, connect your PS3 controller with a Mac or a Windows. Um, you would go to 
this website. You will need, once you get in this website, you would have to click on projects. Let that load. You could also connect your Xbox 360 controller, but since I don't have a I don't have an Xbox 360 controller with me at the moment. I'm using a PS3 controller. So you would just get this. Get version 0.01 and download it. Basically, run it and then uh, install it and restart your computer. Uh, basically, what it is, it's a driver that will make your PS3 compatible with your PS3 controller compatible with your Mac OS X. And I currently have, you will see that I currently have Mac OS version 10.6.4, as you can see. So it's the newest Mac around. Um, and then from, you could also go to this website. There's also SNES emulators, Genesis emulators, and Nintendo 64 emulators, NES emulators, Game Boy Advance emulators, Palm OS emulators, arcade emulators, and x86 emulators, Master System gear, uh, Game Gear emulators, and miscellaneous emulators. So you can go here, once again, that website. Once you uh, download the emulators and all that, you basically run what you want. Like, oh, I want a SNES. Once that's up, you'll know. Nothing will pop up, but on your left top of the screen, we'll say SNES. What you would do is click on that. Preferences. And from there, you would go to. Oh, actually, my bad. Scratch that. You would go to configure. I'm sorry. Configure. Configure controllers. Once you have synced your PS3 controller with your Mac, all you have to do is just click on that. Then on your controller, since it's an up arrow on your analog stick, you would go up. Then you would click on this left, click on it, left. Do the same thing to all of these. L for L trigger, R for R trigger, X for triangle, Y for square, B for X, and A for circle. So on and so forth. Once you have that and you have your ROMs, you're set. Not that hard. Um, so that's pretty much it. Um, like I said, you'll be able to use your PlayStation 3 controller with your Mac OS playing emulators on your Mac. Uh, I hope you uh, enjoyed this video. And if you have any questions, uh, just uh, Put it on the comment section below and I will try to answer as soon as possible. Thanks for watching and have a good day.